Let's try to find grid lamps. Wow, this is awesome. Huge area. So I think his booth was on the left, in the middle. Yeah, flip them over if you want. There, okay. I know we are keep the pile. The ceiling pile I have to kind of keep separate, but that's good. You're good. Thank you. Yeah, of course. Perfect. Future and perfect. Hey, look, the, look what you're starting out with. This oh, year. That's, that's a very popular one. Wow. Nice page. I love it. Yeah. Even before that. <laughs> oh, he's already drawing already. Right. Because people yeah, right yeah, yeah. got a little, little crazy. Oh, that's a great Wolverine cover there too. All right. Love that one. Yeah, the coverage. You can I got a, a red because I don't see that you have one. And these two. Oh, oh that bleed is sick. We're in Orlando. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good. These are the cool Predator vs. Wolverine pages. Oh, there's the Predator vs. Yeah. Wolverine. Yeah, there's this one. You got one too. Got it for oh, Chris. Oh, cool. Blam. There you go. <laughs> How have you been enjoying the Predator vs. Wolverine run you've been doing? Oh, it, it was fun. You know, I just did the one story in issue one. But yeah, it was fun. Yeah, issue one was great. It was yeah. That was a great run. I've been enjoying it. Oh, that Electra piece yeah, is sick. Yeah, that's beautiful. Oh, look at that. That's Ooh. Is it that? That's black, no. white, and blood Electra. Pretty much the newer stuff there. Okay, those are the newer Yeah, and then covers are down yeah, thanks, that way. Red. Okay. Oh, and these are all covers. Those are all. There's like three books. We're out of room, but you can flip through them all. Wow. Yeah, those are all covers. Of books. We live close by, too, so oh, you? it's easier. You know, we can bring more. Oh, yeah. Uh, where are you guys located at? Uh, Trek Tampa. Area. Oh, okay, not far at all. That original X-Men did very well. Like, people, yeah. we didn't even know they'd been shown. Like, they showed five pages, and I'm getting oh, wow. all these calls. Can anybody got page two, and I'm like, I didn't even know it was out. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so it turned out really, a lot of fans out there for x -Men. Oh, that's cool. A little notes. No notes. <laughs> Is this a commission piece you're working on? Yeah, yeah, I've got got a few that I had started at home, and I'll f finish inking them here this weekend. Oh man! And then there's all like the resellers. What are they called? I guess resellers. Yeah, comic I mean, yeah, book dealers. Like, oh yeah, art dealer. I guess that's what it is. All the art. I would think that the uh, oh, artist would have better deals. Oh, there's here. Oh, we had to put some. Oh yeah, Miko's right there. Oh, did he bring his original one? Oh, wow. Good morning, how are you doing? Hi, how are you? Good to see you again. Did you have a fun time last night? Yeah, I had to like uh, go up my room earlier. Yeah. So I feel a bit tired and then oh, we yeah. just, just... Us too, yeah. We, we got out of there right at 9 o'clock. Yeah. We were tired. Oh, really? <laughs> you got some cool are original art here? Uh, no. This, this one? This okay. one. And, and this. And those two? Okay, cool. Some uh, sequentials. Oh, the Joker Harley quiz. Is that Joker Harley? Those are yeah. really nice pages too. What do you use to do these? Mm -hmm. uh, for for the characters, for the people, it's uh, uh, Copic markers. Copic. And then, yeah, and then for the backgrounds, just a uh, regular ink. Nice. Yeah. Shading's awesome. Yep. I love the black and white. I'm trying to find something with maybe like a Joker face on it. That's cool. That is sick. Wow. Joker, Harley, criminal. Sanity. I wonder how much these are. It doesn't look like he's got. Yeah, I don't think there's prices these on are any of them. So. Pricey. I mean, look at that. Yeah, I think it's definitely. These are all oh no, pricey. three thousand. That's the uh, Night Terrors Action Comics cover. Oh. You got Aquaman oh, cool. number four with Mira. Another cover. Oh, I love the Aquaman. Star Wars High Republic. Do you have a favorite publisher you like doing work for? Is that out of like yeah, well, uh, here? They're all the same. I mean, I, I really love the, the characters, so... That voice is just awesome. I really can't say I have a favorite. <laughs> Do you have a favorite character? Uh, like oh, uh, probably uh, uh, Venom. Venom. I've been doing him a lot. Uh, for you have you do a great Venom. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. You do. Thank you. All your stuff is great. Your alien too is awesome. Thank you. Thank you. I just love making Venom. You know. The, 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 oh, Clown Hunter. That's the cover A for the uh, secret. Yeah, secret files. Oh, look at that! The Power Rangers. Yeah, it's gonna be uh, exclusive for. Uh, 
uh, Megacon next week. Oh, really? Oh, that's going to be yeah. a That'll be awesome. Exclusive. We'll see you that's there. Cool. Oh, you'll, you'll be there? Yeah, we'll be yeah, there all we'll four there days. All four we'll days. definitely yep. come check oh, out awesome. what you got going on at your booth. That's a nice cover there. Yeah, thank you. What does something like this go for, usually? Uh, that one goes for around five. Four. Ah, I'm not really good. I'm just the one that's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so you actually don't price your, your own art. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. That's, that's awesome. Yeah, you have someone else just do all the work for you, right? You just have the creative input. Thundercats right there. That is really nice. Uh-huh. Is this covered for the, the new Thundercats coming out with yes. Dynamite? Yes. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, this is the new Dynamite Thundercats that's coming out. It's going to be a really big book. Oh, yeah. I mean, I heard uh, they, um, they, they like uh, sorry, uh, so we had, uh, No, that's fine. Order for like, I don't know if you have 100 Daphne Plus. That is the, uh, that is the recent uh, interior art that I've done. It's like a horror uh, take on the Cyborg DC Superman. Yeah, 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 Cyborg Superman mixed with uh, Superboy. You got a Superboy looks yeah. great there. Oh, thank you. I didn't know where you were coming. Do you have a character that you would like to work on that you haven't worked on before? Uh, I have worked on uh, most of them. Well, uh, probably uh, I would like to do a Doctor Strange. Oh someday. yeah. That'd be cool. I don't think I've ever seen. Yeah, you, you've never yeah. done Doctor Strange. Yeah, wow. That'd be cool. That spawn is sick. Oh, thank you. See, it's it's my entry for uh, Todd's. Uh, oh, the, wow. uh, the, oh, that's your the entry spawn, for the spawn. The spawn you have. Yeah. Thing. Yeah. Wow. That is a great one. That's awesome. I don't think it's it's uh, gonna get picked up because there's a lot of talent to join it. <laughs> oh, really? You think there's people more more talented than you that are? Of course, no. Yeah, I mean. Because I know a lot of people sent in artwork, but I thought it was just a lot of like, um, like people at home sending in stuff. I didn't know there was like actual talent, super talented artists <laughs> trying to get covers on the book. That's awesome. Oh, I love that. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Wow, that is all. How much is something like that? Uh, I think that's 500. 500? Wow. Hey, you are right. That's wow, sick. that is an awesome. I'm a huge Lord of the Rings fan. Really? Oh. How much is that again? 500, right? It's up for auction. Oh, really? Oh, it's up for oh, auction. It's up for All right, so now it's. Well, I should be there. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Probably more than 500, though. That's a sick piece. That's a sick piece. Maybe less. Wow. That'll be cool. Wow, look at that one. Wolverine, not so. Oh, this one's sold, sorry. <laughs> that's the original one. I think they're putting that up for auction today. Oh, that's the original original they did for the badge. I wonder what that'll go for on auction. That's nice. It's interesting to see how much it makes it really nice. Madman comics. Oh, On the lunch boxes are 25. Mm. What's in this one? Static run. Yeah. Oh, those are cool. Oh, Captain Marvel. Oh, Spider Man. Oh, yeah, that was nice. Oh, it looks like he's got lunch boxes, too. Gonna be maybe signing some lunch boxes. Deadpool too soon cover. What made you guys want to do lunch boxes? Uh, when I was a kid, I, collected, I had the Batman, uh, Star Wars, and so when I started doing my comics, the merch guy at Dark Horse Comics said, what's your dream list? And I said, I want metal lunch boxes. Because what had happened was, uh, I, what I'd heard, somebody used them as a weapon, and so they stopped allowing them in schools. Really? Yeah, so they turned to plastic. 
for yeah, years, yeah. there were no metal lunchboxes. Oh, wow. And Dave Scroge at Dark Horse Comics hunted down a company that would do it, and then it brought back the metal lunchbox. That's awesome. So it's very nostalgic for you. That's yeah, cool. nostalgic and also I feel like I accomplished something. <laughs> because now there's metal lunchboxes for uh, dozens of properties. You see them all the time now. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, I started did a spirit one. There's a uh, bone. Uh, Chris Ware. Um, I think everybody. Has. Yeah. So it, it just they. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> did your contribution? <laughs> yeah, I did. If you if you come back and show me that you're wearing one, I'll give you another one. <laughs> another tattoo here, Angelo. Oh, thank you very much. Huh? Thank you. Oh, there's instructions on the back. I think you have to put a wet towel or something. Yeah. One more towel, then just push it. Or even just your. I'm gonna keep mine though. I'm not putting mine on. Yeah, just go outside. Collectible. We'll all have matching tattoos, friendship tattoos. We should all put them on for tomorrow. That's awesome. Feel free to look through things. Commissions planned for the weekend? Oh no. No, we did them all. Did them all already. Yeah. You did them all already. Yeah. Yeah. We wow. yeah pre pre did them. Good thinking. So now you just get to relax. Yeah, like months ago. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, we're truly, this time to just relax. Thank goodness and we didn't wait till last minute because we just came from an ice storm. Yeah. An ice storm? And we, we didn't have Oregon. power. Oh, oh, we were so bad up there. Yeah. It was horrible. We lost, we lost power. We were, we were running. Well, Some people are still out. Like three days, but we Over were going from one house to another house. When that go, we'd move to our kid's house. Then to a hotel. Then to a hotel. Then back. Then everybody came to our house. Like We had but, like six dogs. and. Yeah. But we couldn't even get to a hotel because the roads were. Ice. Like, ice, ice. You can, oh couldn't God. even it's step so on it. I, yeah. I hammered uh, carpet tacks in the bottom of my boots. That was the only way I could yeah, step could on the ice on at all. Yeah. That's scary. It was terrifying. And I, I even with that, I cracked my head. So. Oh, God. Oh, no. Yeah. It was, it was, it was horrible. And freezing. Out of power, and you're freezing. Yeah. But the ice was like five inches thick. It was crazy. It was. Oh but God. glass, glass. Yeah. That's horrible. So that's what we did right before we came here. I'm so glad you, you made it to Orlando. So this yeah. is very We got different. here in the nice warm weather. It's 80 degrees. <laughs> it's the complete opposite. <laughs> Rough one out. Oh, that's amazing. It's, it's that I, I, just in terms of like budgetary constraints and probably more along the side. Sure, that's the one I did. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, like I said, if we could have any sort of like just a little bit like, of a little bit of background. I'm not saying it's a good advantage. Sure. Yeah. But yeah, what are those? I've never seen those before. I would, I would love to make. Is that like artwork or so like a? Uh, it's, it's basically the colored art. Yeah. Then, then you'll get more the original. Than you originally thought. It's what yeah. the book is actually <laughs> printed from. So if you if you're familiar with comic art fans, um, Matt and I did a, um, an interview and um, art sale back in July. You can just do Matt Wagner interview art sale. Very He describes the entire process, like the one hour mark of that um, of that interview. But it's pretty fascinating. But these are the yeah. Kamiko original printing console. Yeah. Oh, uh, and that, was, idea that was sold too. <laughs> I'm, I'm, but yeah, um, that's it. Do I? Do I? Do I? Oh wow! Look at that Batman Beyond. That is sick. Sean Gordon Murphy yours? and Batman yeah. Beyond. That's very cool. No, 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 I'm not smoking the meal. He's not here right now. But he will. Yep. Yeah. How much does something like that go for? That's a little bit more than that usual remark. Usually it's a hundred for remark. Usually a hundred? Okay. If anyone yeah. asks. But it's usually okay. not <laughs> that elaborate. This just happened to be the We're first one of the day, so it's warming up. Yeah. So a little bit more. But usually I want to do like a usually show stopper for the first one. Very quickly. Like just says, you know? yeah. Yeah. A little bit longer than that. Oh, you got lucky getting the first yeah. one, huh? <laughs> I got carried away and you're benefiting from this, so it's okay. <laughs> That's good. That's still going to happen. Yeah, that is awesome. I'm a huge Batman Beyond fan, so that's, that's great. Got some original pieces here. Yeah, these are really sick. Oh, that's cool. I like the design. Yeah. Oh, Zorro, that's awesome. Oh, that one's only 300 bucks. Yeah, this is nice. With the Joker? This is for amazing stories. I wish I could get the little cutout of this and put it on there. I think these are the covers. 
Yeah. What is that right there? That's Rogue and Gambit. Right. Oh yeah. It's, oh, it's like a pack of yeah. So it's hundred bucks for ten. Points. Nine prior years designs and one OAX exclusive X Men print. Oh. Yeah. So ten in total. That's really cool. Oh wow, look at that. That's a sick cover. Yeah, these are all the variants though, the for the Batman Beyond. Oh, look at that. He's got this one over here though. That's the uh, looks yeah. like a like a prelim, I think, is what it's called. So I think you get the set with it. Are you selling these ones separately from these, or does it We're come together? We're doing it with the cover. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So is this usually how it looks though? Before? Yeah. So like he typically it, does a small drawing. That's only like three by five or two by four. Oh wow! So that's how it starts. Concept, yeah. And then working out the larger size, and then pencils the larger size, then inks it. So it's kind of a four-step process. So Good. first is a small design, figure out spacing. I, I two, pleasure, man. Three is the pencils, and then four are the final inks. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. There's the final Batman Beyond piece. That is awesome. All right, so we're in line for Sean Gordon Murphy. We're going to get something done in the sketchbook, obviously a Batman. So, pretty excited. This is going to be our first work in the sketchbook at the Orlando Art Convention. Right here. Should we do it on the other page because this one has little things? Uh, I'll leave it up to him. We'll okay. choose. All right, I'll tell him you can do it on that or the other one. Detective Comics 1000 variant cover. Let's continue looking through some of these covers. So from start to finish, how long would something like this usually take? Cover? Mm, probably a couple days. A day and a half. Day and a half. Wow, day and a half. Boom, right there. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Sean, how long did it take you to get your style? Uh, 20 years. 20 when, uh, years. Uh, yeah, I mean, it, it changes every day, you know? But I think your your exceptional detail with the cars is just crazy. Thanks, man. Crazy. Are you a car guy? Uh, yeah, yeah, nice. sorry. What do you drive? Um, right now, um, it's a kid. Tell your ride. Yeah, all Oh, dude, those are great. Yes. People were paying over asking for those things. Yeah, that yeah, was one of them. It's like $120,000. Oh, heck no, not that, that way. Not yeah. that much. <laughs> I have a Kia Stinger. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, I love it, man. I love that. Oh wow, oh, someone no, beyond here. Still at Metropolis, and they said they will return back. Wow, <laughs> they're still at Metropolis at the time. What? Um, I guess, but. Don't oh wow, look at that! It's the thing. Good morning, sir. Good morning. White Knight, your most popular title that you get asked to sign? Uh, yeah, for sure. Batman's a force of nature in comics, so. I wish I could take credit for it, but really it's mostly Batman. No, you do a, a great job. There's so many people that love your art style. I, I know a lot of people in the comic book community locally, and there's a lot of people that collect your artwork. Is there any characters you haven't worked on before that you would like to? 
Uh, yeah, I'm an X-Men fan. Sometime I'd like to visit that. Which characters in specific? Uh, do Gambit. Yeah, that would be great. Give, him, give Gambit his year one. Give him like finally like a really really good oh, undeniable Gambit book. Thanks, man. Take care. Oh, hello. Right. Hey, wait, I need it's that like bottle in time. Sure. Get a trade. You want Batman? Yeah, I think I gotta okay. get Batman. You can use this page if you want. It has some little splatters. Or, or you would you um? One. Would you rather do Joker? I'll, I'll leave it up to you. I'm all warmed up by Batman. <laughs> so I'll take a Batman. <laughs> okay. Uh, so do you want me to do a sideways like this? Whatever you, you, whatever whatever you prefer, you prefer yeah. So who got into comics first? Oh, that yeah, would be me. Comics first, yeah. yeah. And then here I am. Yeah. <laughs> I was lucky that she she was you, so cool you know with what it. You're getting into? Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever done any work on anything other than comics for your work? Yeah, I've done some video game stuff. Yeah. Um, I worked with Harley Davidson recently. Oh, that's awesome. You get some weird side gig every now and then that you wouldn't expect, you know. That's pretty cool though. Yeah. Do you have a dream car that you wish to own one day? Yeah, I'm actually, I own it. Uh, I have a 500 horsepower Datsun that I had built like a race car. That's cool. Um, we had a Netflix deal go through a few years ago and I was allowed to buy a, a dumb car, so I did. <laughs> Which Netflix was that? Uh, it was optioned, it's called Chrononauts. Um, you know Mark Millar? Yeah. So he sold like eight different things to Netflix and I was one of the guys. So I wish I could take credit for it, but it was mostly his hard work and we all, we all paid off. What other comics do you guys like to read? I'm really big into Vampirella. Nice. The magazine. I'm trying to complete the whole run. I'm working on it. Like the classic one? Yeah. Are those expensive? Um, it depends. The like really early ones, and if you want them in nice condition, which are hard to find because right. they're <laughs> old magazines. Yeah. Um, so some of them are pretty cheap, you know, like twenty, forty dollars, and then the early ones go for like a few hundred. Really? The yeah. Number ones like a few thousand. Yeah. yeah. Do you collect comics at all? Uh, yeah, not as much as I used to. I definitely take more out than I put in. What are your thoughts on the current comic book industry? Do you have any thoughts on it? Yeah, I think we're in trouble. <laughs> uh, COVID sort of um, delayed some inevitability as far as publishers, uh, you know, too much content, too much product, too, prices are too high, there's no digital strategy. Um, I love it, but the movies and video games made a ton of money over the years, but comics really didn't. So I think we're just going to have growing pain just like anything else. Yeah, it's simple. Do you want to take a look at the folios? Sure. Have you always used that like, ink medium? Yep. Yeah, that's where most of my money comes yeah. from is original art sales, I'd say. Yeah, a lot of newer artists don't do the original art like this, so they don't have the art to sell, I guess, as often. Yeah. Yeah, some people just do the digital. They're learning. Like, Simone is, was digital, but now he does some pieces as traditional. And uh, he was making more money, which is good. Yeah. That's the thing, is the industry changes. You've got to find sideways, uh, other ways of making money. And mm -hmm. digitals, like shows like this, basically, are uh, almost necessary. And we have some and prelims in the air. Do you have anything planned, like big projects in the works? Yep. I got Zorro coming out right now. I have the rights to Zorro. Alright, this might be my favorite piece in the whole book. <laughs> that is sick. I'm a huge Batman fan, so...
just in case. It should be mostly dry, but... And this careful. is the new Zorro book, right? Yep, that's Man of the Dead. That's out right now. Issue yeah. 1 just came out uh, a couple weeks ago. I'll have to check this out at the comic book shop. Thank you thank so you much. I appreciate yeah. it. The rest of your weekend. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. Take care. You too. That thing is sick. I got a close-up of that. Look at that. That's awesome. That? I that gotta admit, that is... Probably the best one, right? That like is the amazing. favorite? Yeah. I am in shock right now how that turned out. It feels so quick. That's awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. Feel free to take a look through any of the portfolios you see here. I'm all full of original art from different price ranges. If you need any prices, you let me know. I'm Matt, and these are the two Simones. The two Simones? Yes. Mio and Bianca.